Hey y'all, I'm Jordan from Iodin Sounds. I took a break from the music today <laughs> to mix on CMOS. CMOS is, let me get a close up of the CMOS. Um, it's a sea plant that has 92 vitamins and minerals. And your body is composed of 102, so it's only lacking 10 out of the complete array that would fully condition your body to be in its proper functioning order. Okay, you get the sea moss, you take it out the bag, it's gonna have salt on it, right? So we're gonna go over here to the sink and rinse the salt off for a good bit, you know. They got all kind of people um, cutting grass and all kind of thing in the background, so you hear that bit, sorry. So we're gonna get over here, rinse this out, a bunch of time. We got that while I'm rinsing this out, we got that new midnight CD coming up. Actually we got three midnight CDs coming out. We got the new the newest one coming out first. It has like hip hop beats, trap beats, R and B beats. Real one for the youth bin to gravitate to. Um I got another album coming out, the fifth one. And I got a lot of songs I like on that. It's gonna, I think it's going to be a real good album. It's got trap beats, rap beats, reggae beats. A lot of nice reggae beats for me. It's actually like, you know, I always got conscious lyrics, but... Anything we do, we ain't going to be out. Ooh, baby, I love you, and party in the club, and get twisted and all that shit. No, we staying positive and clear. And morals and values and attitudes and keeping it up. Okay, back to the sea moss. We got it rinsed out a little bit. And I'm gonna find me a pot to put in. And this amount, you know, like a, a, a handful amount right here. I keep looking at the wrong side of the camera over here again. But um, like a handful amount, this could make like a gallon and so you know. So, I'd have tasted it. I mean, it's for me. But. So I wouldn't do this shit if I was making it for somebody else. See, that's still salty, so we're going to go back over here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, man. Fresh and tippy thing and big. We're going over with the DJ thing. Am I doing good? The dub thing, real nice. If you haven't heard about that, check that out. Dub in the rainforest. Check out Fresh out new CD, The Sound. Check out the um, CD with I grade and Midnight called uh, Beauty for Ashes. That's a bad CD. Real good CD, man. They view that number four. Real good. Nice production. I believe it's the Zion I King. The little link up. Okay. I got the salt off now. You see me? No salt. Because if you mess around and keep salt on this thing, yeah, put it in the pot. And I put a little bit of water, you know? I don't do a whole lot of water. It just depends on what you're really trying to do. If you want to make uh, it one time, then you could put a good amount of water in this day. But I like to put in like Check it out. Oh shit, I'm pouring all over the place. You know, like, not the, just like about, about to right here, you know? So it could make like a gel and it's gonna be thick, thick, thick. So I could just put in something and put it in the fridge. And whenever I want to make like a smoothie or something, I could just throw it in and, or make it one time heat up some water and, you know, all of that. So we gotta light it up. Keep the fire blazing. <laughs> Don't blow up myself. No, that's no good. That shit ain't in my life. Burn off all my hair up there. <laughs> Thank you, man. Okay. Just gonna let that dead boil. 
It's a simple thing, and they're like, how do you make sea moss? Is it Irish moss? Is there a difference between Irish moss and sea moss? And moss? I think there is, though, because that one there that I showed you, this white one, the Irish moss that you buy in the store in the States is kind of like a gray and brown and chipped up looking. And, but I believe it's the same thing. I don't know. I think we just probably got a fresher one because it's in the Caribbean, you know. But it's really good for you. 92 vitamins and minerals. I'm going to take a break right now because it's just going to... Uh, I can't be sitting here. I ain't, I'm kind of... You know. I'm trying to get to... Yeah. I'll be back to you in a minute. When this done's boy... Okay. Yeah. Blah, blah. Yeah, man. We back. The thing boiling good now. You got to leave it boil for a while. So I cut it off and... <laughs> uh, <laughs> came back. The thing looking well proper, man. Well nice, the thing looking. You know, let me show you. It is almost done. Almost. You know. Once you say, hey, and if you leave this stuff boiling on the stove and you're like, oh, let me go outside and do something. This, it will be everywhere, Jack, because it, it bubbles up. It'll be bubbling up. I'm trying to get it without messing up the camera, but check it out, boiling. Got all hot and sweaty all over the iPad, Jack. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> Pat, now we have the thing boiling well and it is looking gelish, you know. It, if it is the gel, then it's proper. <laughs> Check it. Yes, man. Okay. I'm going to lock off the stove now. You ever, you ever, you ever walk around there, man? Bye. Move in the way now, bye. What is wrong with you? Moving the way! You're like, what? What does that mean? <laughs> Get out of the way, partner! You're blocking my way from moving! Easy! Okay. I'm locking it off because I don't like to boil it too long. Because when, when you boil it too long and too hot, certain amino acids and vitamins and minerals do deteriorate. And destroy from certain heat temperatures so just take a little more time and some patience keep it on low and once you know some people like to really melt it down but I like to keep it like this yeah you know shit we can see it keep it like that you know once you can cut through it with the fork once it's looking like those once it's looking like this, yeah, you know? Wow. I like to leave it just so. Once you could cut through it, it's ready. It is ready. Just so. And we're rolling. And I'm gonna come back to you in a minute. Because I'm gonna let it cool off for about five minutes. And I don't wanna be here just running my mouth for five minutes. So I'm gonna come back. And I'm going to show you how to deal with it in the blender. Okay, we're back. We're back. Yeah, partner, we're back, you know. Okay. Um. I made this. I made, I made a good bit. So like I have some for an, another time, you know. I'm going to put it in the fridge. But to make some... To make some sea moss... <laughs> I go about like this, you know, you ain't got to put a whole heap, if you put a lot, lot, it's going to be thick and, and like, you know, once it gets cool, it's going to be like, friggin' jello, man, got the agave, Whew. you know, get the rings in there, player made agave, <laughs> I don't like my stuff real sweet. Maybe some people got real sweet too, right? But I'm not into it. I don't like real sweet stuff. I usually just use water, but since people want like the what they, you know what they want, I put some almond, put some almond milk. I gonna put the thing back down. Put some almond milk in it. And then I had to put some water in it. And 
then we blend in this here. I blended it for about three minutes. Everybody in the house bent. But um, it's got the right consistency now. Check it out. Classic Sima. I put some vanilla essence in it. But then this is this is what you want. This is what people don't want, you know? That's what they want. Bow. Like bubbles, like a bubbly, you know? Smooth. Cheers, friends. Cheers. <laughs> yeah, man. I hope y'all could make it for yourself now. If you didn't know. All right. Bless. <laughs> Check out the new CDs. Check out the uh, upcoming Midnight Iordan Sounds upcoming Iordan album. Check out Tippy. Uh, and pressure the sound to check out Tippy and Midnight Ashes for Babylon. Or wait, Beauty for Ashes. Yeah, Beauty for Ashes. And you know, check out the VI local artists, all that. Boom, bam, bam, bow. Enjoy a nice glass of sea moss and get healthy and nice. Feel nice like spice. Do it twice. Yeah. Okay. Bless. Oh, I forgot one thing. Like with the extra, I put it like this, yeah. So, you put it in the fridge, and then, like if you make a smoothie, or if you want to make sea moss again, then you just scoop out the chunk and put it in, and blend it up. But, I hope y'all find this video 